I parked in the damn field. And I'm getting swarmed by bugs, so I'm gonna make this quick. What is going on, you dirty old stash bags? It's me again. And I got something very special planned today. I'm gonna get swarmed by bugs for a while while I'm talking to you. And uh, then I'm gonna walk out yonder way into this forest. Little puddle, little creek. Try to catch some giant fish. No night crawlers today. I'm not bringing them. I'm taking a stand against the dirty old night crawlers and the dirty old tiny fish. And I'm gonna be throwing some giant lures into tiny little spaces and uh, seeing if we can't get bit. I'm not gonna catch a lot of fish today. I've been making a lot of videos that I catch a lot of fish that aren't very big. Today, we're shooting for one, maybe two, we get three, I'm gonna freak out. So, if you uh, haven't subscribed already, please subscribe. Fish a lot of puddles, fish a lot of creeks, fish a lot of small areas, fish for a lot of different species, so there's, uh, there's stuff for everybody. But, uh, yeah, I'm gonna stop talking. I'm gonna quit getting swarmed by bugs. We're gonna walk yonder way through the damn forest, get all ticked up, and then hopefully, Get your giant fish. Come on with me, pa pow, and stuff. <coughs> I swallowed one that wasn't even fake. Alrighty, not sure if there's a good way to do this. Just gonna have to take it slow. I don't even know where the water is. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's embarrassing. I literally just completely ate it. All right, I need to take my time. I don't think I've fallen on that hard on camera yet. It's kinda hurt. Nothing like walking through six foot tall grass to start your morning. We made it. Never give up. And stuff. My buddy Dylan is meeting me down here. The one who helped me record the uh, car getting yanked out of the lake. If you haven't watched that video, go watch it sad and funny at the same time. But yeah, he's gonna meet me down here in a little bit. He'll probably throw some smaller stuff around, so maybe he'll have a better chance of getting one, but I'm sticking with the big baits as long as possible. And I'll show you what I mean by big baits here in a little bit, once I get there. Yep, that looks pretty glorious. Not gonna lie. 10 out of 10 on the presentation of the spillway. Water's kind of clean, flowing. Not flowing too hard though. That's what she said, I think. All right, so I just went to the local Dirty Shields. Picked up a couple big baits. Pa-pow. Giant squid looking lure thing. See how long it takes for you guys to figure out what I'm fishing for. And let's see how long it takes for me to uh, lose this lure. Because spillways are snaggy. But if I lose it, I guess I lose it. All right, well, send old squid Timmy in there and see if we can't get chomped. Feeling pretty good about it, but these fish definitely are temperamental and they're eating, either biting or they're not. So hopefully they're bitey. What's up, Billy? Oh, I'm already here. Oh God, there's one right in front of me. I gotta go. All right, bye. Buddy Dylan just called me and one was just swimming right in front of me. We'll try this for a little bit. I've never even thrown this lure before, so I have no idea how I'm supposed to work it. But I'm going to try it anyway. I just saw one of the target species. It wasn't a big one, but it was one. So let's see if we can get one on the giant bait. Comment down below if there's a certain way I'm supposed to work this thing. Am I just supposed to straight retrieve it or am I supposed to jerk it or... Oh, one just followed it. There seems to be a lot of them. I think we're gonna catch some today, boys and girls. I just don't know if it'll be on this. I think I'm gonna lose it already. <laughs> Gotta at least try to get it back. We do have one other big bait. If I lose this one this fast, we got a backup. Feels pretty in there. Oh. Oh, he chased it. I don't know if you guys saw that, but one chased it in. The ones I'm seeing aren't very big though. 
I might have to try the other lure. Got one. Got one. Oh my god. That was a big one. Holy shit. Oh god. This is gonna be interesting. That was not small. It's gonna be a good day, boys and girls. Oh, I just had one. I'm way too excited right now. My leg is shaking. I think bit right at my feet. I just had a giant. What? Yeah, I just had one that was probably upper 30s, if not 40. No, it ate it. But I've seen like four of them. Buddy Dylan made it down. Say hi, Dylan. I think we're going to catch a couple, bud. I'm already too excited, Dylan. I'm, I, need, I need to calm down. All right, I'm going to try my other big bait. You're not seeming to want to commit to that very well. I got the bite, but we'll go back to it eventually. As of now, I got another lure to try. We should probably get the net ready. <laughs> I'm literally shaking and I haven't even caught one. All right. We're gonna catch one. All right, my other big lure isn't quite as big, but it's definitely still big, especially for fishing a spillway. It's called the double cowgirl or the reverse cowgirl. I prefer reverse cowgirl, but we'll call it a double cowgirl for now. Or maybe it's a single cowgirl, I don't know. All I know is I did not set the hook hard enough into that fish that bit. I couldn't believe it was happening. Let's go try the other side. Cast right here one more time. Nothing wanted the double cowgirl. So far. Where'd they all go? Let's go back to big dong lure. Got something? What was it? Yeah. Something. Yeah. Still something though. That's one. There it is. The old small bait's getting it done. You think it's a what? Nice. <laughs> That's still cool. I, I don't can't believe that. I don't know if that drum can eat this. <laughs> <laughs> still sweet though, man. You got us on the board. You feel a lot bigger. Yeah, the current and stuff. Oh, one just followed it. Getting a bunch of follows. Just can't seal the deal. I really want to catch one on this, but I ain't gonna use it forever. That one that bit this was big. Hmm, what to do, what to do. Started out hot and heavy. Might try like a chatterbait or something, I don't know. They don't seem super fired up, but obviously there's a way to get them to go, because I already got one to go. Well, since they seem to be a little bit smaller, most of them, I'm gonna try some bass stuff. All right. Try a numbers bait for a little bit. I was getting them to follow the big giant squid thing, but they aren't really falling anymore and they definitely aren't committing to it anymore. And the one that did commit to it didn't even really have it that far into his mouth. He kind of just nudged it. So throw around a little snatch for a little bit, see what happens. Wow, that feels like I'm throwing nothing after throwing that big bait. Literally feels like I don't even have a lure on. We aren't really doing it so far, bud. Yeah, we can always do some exploring too. Thought I had one. You know you're losing it when the snags start feeling like fish. I don't even know what else to try. I guess maybe a lipless over and over again. Seems to be working. Hooked a giant right off the bat and then nothing. We just aren't landing them, bud. We were seeing them everywhere too. I haven't seen one for a while. Maybe they all swam down the creek. I doubt it though. Lure number 97.
Got one. Got one. It ain't big, but... Oh, no! Should have just kept the line tight instead of walking. Shit. We're cursed. Old movement, get the bite. Gotta keep plugging away, bud. We just gotta get one in the damn net. As soon as I wanna give up, something like that happens. I know, it hammered it too. Shit the bed. I couldn't even believe it was real. Not too devastated because I wasn't a giant one. And in the summer, muskies always get stressed out, so. Probably wasn't a terrible thing that he came off. I mean, I want to get my hands on something, for God's sake, but I'm not too devastated. Got to land something, so... I don't have to make a non-fish catching video. I'm gonna stick with the movement for a while, though, but... I'm gonna keep switching lures, see if I can't piss one off. I wasn't recording like an idiot, because I'd given up, but... Oh, never mind. Well, that's not a good way to end it. I ain't that worried about it. I don't think he bit it. Here, just keep him in the water. Yeah, just lean him in. <coughs> I don't care if he gets away. You can just let him out. I didn't even have my camera on either, but. Thought he hit it, I threw it at the tube and it was just sinking and then all of a sudden it was going that way, but I guess there's so many of them in here, they just, I don't know, just run into one every now and again. Yeah, I don't think they're starving. Well, that could have been good, but instead it's the first video that I've made in a long time that I actually haven't caught a fish. Well, right at the end I hooked one in the tail on accident with a big Medusa. Squid, green and orange and yellow thing. But my camera wasn't on when I hooked it. I don't know if I'm gonna include it, but uh, got it in the net, unhooked it, and uh, yeah, I just let it swim on. No hero shots with a muskie snagged in the ass. But yeah, I don't know. It started out early. There was a uh, definitely a window of opportunity that was not capitalized on. Had that bigger bite right at the beginning. Got all jacked up. Thought it was gonna be the best damn day of my life. Instead, I got zero fish for the first time in a long time. And it's definitely the first time in a long time I'm gonna make a video with zero fish. Dylan already had it out. He was sick of it too. But yeah, I'm getting sunburnt with my bro tank, so I need to get the hell out of here and get some sunscreen or something to go inside so I don't start peeling. But uh, yeah, if you want me to try these big baits in small areas videos again, comment down below. Stay tuned. More Puddle Muskie videos to come. Hopefully I can actually seal the deal, but they are muskies. It's not like I'm bass fishing, so. Or cat fishing, or carp fishing, or something stupid like that. They're muskies, so they're hard to catch. So I can live with myself for making this video. But hopefully you guys can live with me for making this video. And if you like this video, leave a thumbs up, leave a comment, and subscribe. Definitely appreciate all the support. Definitely appreciate all, appreciate all of you. I'm out of here. Goodbye.